Hi there and welcome back to Belleville Toyota. I'm Bronwyn and in today's video we are talking about the start-stop engine system. More specifically, its purpose, parameters, and some considerations while the system is in operation. We will be demonstrating on a 2022 Highlander XSE. To help me explain, I invited a special guest from our service department. Dave is a service technician and technical advisor here at Belleville Toyota. Hey guys, I'm here today to explain the stop-start system to you. Toyota started using the stop-start system on certain models beginning in the year 2017. Its purpose is to improve fuel economy and reduce emissions. The stop-start system does not operate every time you stop your car. It can be turned off pushing this button. This button's located in different places on different vehicles, but if your car has this system, it has this button. It will not stay turned off. You have to restart it every time you start the car. It'll default to back on. The stop-start system is controlled by the engine computer. The computer monitors 40 different parameters and decides when and if to use the stop-start system. Some of the most common things that we hear are, well, my stop-start system doesn't work if my defrost is on. It doesn't work if the temperature outside is minus five degrees or colder and it doesn't work when I first start the vehicle. The car has to be at full operating temperature. The ambient air temperature outside has to be more than minus five Celsius. The battery has to be fully charged. The brake pedal has to be fully depressed for the stop start system to work. If those things don't happen, it doesn't run. Also, it's common for people to notice that the 12 volt power outlets will momentarily turn off and back on when uh, the stop start system activates. That's normal. Also, sometimes people complain about a brake noise. It's important to note that if the stop start system activates when you're on an uphill, the computer will keep brake pressure applied when you release the brake pedal and step on the gas. And once the engine starts, it'll release. That's so that you don't roll backwards this will cause a brake noise. It's going to happen and it's normal. That's about it. Thanks for watching guys. And that is all for today's video on the engine start stop system. Hopefully this gives you a little bit more insight to how the system operates in your Toyota vehicle. I'm Bronwyn from Bevel Toyota. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.